hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to make a simple makeup pulse so let's get started the materials and measurements are listed in the description box in this DIY, I'm going to be working with three different materials, Ankara, Brighter Satin, and an interfacing. The interfacing I'm using is a gum stay. So we're going to be using the gum stay just to give the horse a little structure. So the interfacing, I'm going to be using it on my Ankara fabric alone. Using my steam iron, I'm going to gum it with the fabric. Now to make the inner part of the pores neat, I like to overlock the edges of the fabric as well as the lining. I normally use the overlock method when I have bulk orders because I need them for business. So if you're not making it for business, you're just making it for yourself, then you don't need to worry about this because it's actually optional. Next step is to secure the fabric together, the lining and the anchor fabric. I'm going to secure it together and take it to my sewing machine. Then I'm going to sew all the way around. For the edges of the zipper, I cut out a small piece of wider satin. So I'm going to be putting it at the edge of the zipper. As time goes on, you understand what it's actually meant for. I'm going to be sewing it on the zipper by one inch. So the next step, we are going to give it a good press. And we are going to stop stitch it. Now I'm going to repeat the same process for the other side of the fabric, just like this. So now we are going to turn the fabric inside out. And after that, we are going to place the zipper at the middle. So before we top stitch the edges, we are going to turn the zipper holder inside so we don't end up sewing it alongside the edges of the fabric. For the four corners, we are going to do this. This can be very tricky, but all you have to do is just form a triangular shape, like you want to make a third bag. So I'm going to be sewing the four corners by one inch. Now you can see our post is finally taking shape. All you have to do is trim all four corners can decide to overlock the edges as well. 
and we are done so thank you so much guys for watching my video remember to like comment share and subscribe see you next week